Hey Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having a fantastic day so far. I am going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you at this moment, what is going on right now in your current situation with you and the person that is on your mind, if any. So whenever you do come across this reading, it will be the right time for you to see it. As always, take what resonates, leave out the rest, practice using your own discernment. And if you're interested in a personal reading, all of that information will be left in the description box below for you all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you can be updated for future videos. And also, uh, don't forget to follow me on all social media as well, TikTok, Instagram. I am spiritually goldy on all platforms. So, wow, Cancer. There's something, there's something that you may have seen that caught you by surprise. It was unexpected. This may have been something you saw through your phone even. Something that you saw that like blindsided you. Seeing we have the Eight of Swords here, you may have felt like blindsided. Um, really in your head, it took you by surprise. I'm seeing like you weren't expecting this. You had other expectations from the situation or other expectations on a person. Like this really caught you. It was really unexpected what you saw. And I'm seeing it got you all up in your head. You may have felt like you were stuck or vulnerable because you are following your heart i'm seeing we have the prince of cups like you are following your heart following your emotions um and i'm seeing that you are moving forward with your heart on your sleeve towards someone And I, I see you, you really have tried to invest into a new beginning, into a new start and grow something and, and make a commitment, plant a seed and really commit to making something grow, building trust and, and building something solid. There was someone around you who was still healing from something. We have the star. So this person was still healing from a situation that may have um, ended for them. So right now, there may be a separation or a breakup. I'm seeing we have a breakup and we have the coffin. So something transforming in your life, something ending for you to have a new beginning for yourself here. A struggle. I see that you've been looking at this situation like it was a struggle. You may be feeling helpless at this point. A broken commitment. Yeah. There's communication I'm seeing is very immature. Or somebody has the inability to have a mature conversation here. Like a grown up conversation and just talk about the facts and have be honest right i'm seeing that this person this there's someone around you i see coming towards you trying to make you a small offer or make some sort of gesture to wanting a, to have a new start with you this person wants to make a an investment into you and they want to try to gain your trust Someone's trying to gain your trust, but in a small way. But I'm seeing that you've given away your power to someone. And it's almost like you're struggling to try to regain your power back. The Emperor reversed. And the Hier Hierophant reversed.
there's something you're going back and forth with when it comes to a decision. Something may be far or distant or you feel like it's far off. I'm getting that what you really want is someone to be serious or something to move towards the next step or the next level in a relationship or to have something last and something solid but at the same time it's like you're not going after what you want because I'm seeing the communication it's like there's issues with communication here or there's issues with someone being open and honest and I, I'm getting that you you sense that you sense that somebody's not being transparent with you like some suspicious all right so I'm seeing a false person again like this person they're hiding something from you. There's something that they're still attached to. I'm seeing addiction. Something, someone that they're still very much like they have some sort of unhealthy attachment to. And it could be a person. Um, Queen of Wands here. This person, they feel passionate about you. I'm seeing that they do feel passionate about you. Um, they feel like this situation... Um, is getting a lot of attention but they also feel like um, it's over and it's and it's done with we have death here they see that you've given up or you're no longer wanting to fight for this because you have um, overwhelmed yourself in this situation they feel like you're just not willing to to have a new beginning with them but they're trying to prepare or they're in the process here where they want to take um, a leap of faith towards you. They want to take action towards you here. They want to communicate and tell you the truth about a situation there's a lot that needs to be talked about a lot that they have to say that they haven't said so this person is aware that they haven't been completely honest or they haven't been telling you the whole story to something i see them planning or trying to figure out how to say this to you how to tell you the truth and they feel like it's risky it's risky to have this conversation or to tell you this but i see them taking a risk and opening up a conversation here that they may uh, have to do with their past or a person from their past. So think of the person that's on your mind, Cancer. Let's see what they want to say to you. What does this person want to say to you? past lives I remember you so this person still thinks about you there's so much so there's so many things I want to tell you unspoken so yeah there's a lot that they haven't told you there's and they're gonna tell you about it like they're planning on telling you about um, these things about some sort of truth that they have um, there's unfinished business there's so much unresolved stuff between us so they, they're trying to take a risk and to tell you what they haven't told you before. Right now they're a mess. Self-care. I'm a mess right now. That's why I'm focusing on me. Transformation. I'm changing my ways. So yeah, they're trying to change. They're trying to be better. At the bottom of the deck, jealousy. I'm jealous of everyone close to you. They get jealous um, with the attention that you get or they feel like you get a lot of attention because they feel this person looks at you like you're very attractive okay so let's look at the near future we do have the five of swords so you are going to really go through an eye-opening experience here because you're going to see somebody's true character somebody's 
truth. Like they, they're gonna, they're taking this risk to tell you this. And you may be, find out that they're still attached to something imprisoned. But it may be a harsh conversation because a lot of things are coming to light, coming to reality, justice. You're going to make a decision here for yourself, a fair decision because they haven't been fair with you. I'm seeing you realizing that this person causes you anxiety or this person is just not good for your mental health. They want another chance with you and they want to try to have some more stability here. So judgment, like they, they want a new start with you, but, and they're trying to change their ways, but what they tell you, like what, what they still have to tell you is like, it may not be enough. For you to want another chance with them because this person has been lying to you we have the seven of swords reversed you're gonna figure out that they've lied to you and you're gonna catch them you're gonna catch them in the act possibly for some of you you're gonna catch this person in the in their own lie somebody had lied or has been keeping this a secret scared that you would find out fears This may be regarding something that happened in a home or a house. But the but things are coming to light here big time. Big time. You're going to see someone for who they truly are. Queen of Swords. Yeah, the truth is coming out. And I see you using your discernment and cutting cords, honestly. I see you cutting cords with this person. It's like there's no going back after this 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 truth comes out here yeah somebody's not as solid as you thought they were it looks like a head over heart decision you're going to end up making here it's been a long journey for you but your journey is your this tough journey that you've been trying to navigate it is ending when you use your own discernment here the numbers I'm seeing is 28, 8, 19, 29, and 20. So with that being said, this is what I'm getting. If it resonated, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want. It helps me out and it helps the channel. And I hope that you all have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.